Hello people, my name is Mohit and today uh, I'm going to uh, take you through a tutorial in Adobe Flash CS5 and uh, I'm going to walk you through keyboard events before I actually uh, show you the actions panel and um, explain it to you the action script 3 that is let me uh, give you a publish preview and let's see what exactly happens here I'm going to press control enter on the keyboard simultaneously okay here goes now guys this uh, small uh, rectangle will react to the keyboard I'm going to press the right arrow on the keyboard and see what happens on the uh, screen as well as uh, the output panel in the output panel it traces uh, it outputs a message which says uh, the right key was pressed and there are two numbers there 39 and 39 if I press the left arrow nothing happens if I press the up arrow key on the keyboard nothing happens the down arrow nothing happens again I'm going to press right arrow once again and the same message appears the right key was pressed and uh, not only that if you notice guys the rectangle the gray rectangle with, with the black shadow also moves towards the right it is going along the x-axis okay by um, a few pixels now let's see what's uh, going on what is firing off this uh, movement or the animation I'm going to open up this uh, the actions panel now guys uh, it's not a very good practice what I've done is I've placed the action script on the same uh, frame as the object the the rectangle but uh, it's a very good idea to have it on different layers nevertheless uh, there's nothing stopping us from putting it on the same layer I'm going to open up the actions panel and guys uh, in line number one I've attached an event listener to the stage guys whenever you want keyboard interaction it has to be on the stage it cannot be on a button or a movie clip it's got to be on the stage that's rule number one okay cool and uh, what does the event listener do it listens for a keyboard event to be uh, precise it listens for a keyboard down event okay and uh, the moment the uh, the specific key on the keyboard is pressed down it's got to execute a function called my function so the stage is uh, requested to please listen for a keyboard event a key down event specifically guys you can also change it to key underscore up it's absolutely all right okay so we have two variations key down and key up underscore up that is okay guys what does uh, does this function my function do uh, my function will react to the keyboard event the key down event specifically and it will check a condition okay it will check if the key code of the key pressed it's going to check if the key code when the key is pressed what is the event the event is the press of the key on the keyboard and it will check if the key code is equal to keyboard dot right so it's basically uh, checking if the key pressed on the keyboard is the right arrow key and if it is the right arrow key it's going to trace the right key was pressed in the output panel here okay it's going to trace the right key was pressed also it's going to move with the movie clip my underscore my mc which is this uh, rectangle along the x-axis 10 pixels it's also going to trace the value of event dot key code and uh, keyboard dot write both of them are equal to 39 guys and guys since the value of event dot key code as well as keyboard dot write equals 39 this function will fire off only when the right key is pressed on the keyboard so guys I hope you learned something very good useful uh, I'll see you next time with yet another tutorial on Adobe CS5, uh, could be Flash CS5, ActionScript 3, Dreamweaver CS5 or Fireworks CS5. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Ciao.